shopped the sale four times. Somebody come take my card. Hey besties, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jada Simone and you're watching Jada's channel. I don't love just anyone. I am not just anyone. I rock heels, I rock Jordans. And I wear wigs and rock my natural. Can you believe it says I'm pretty for a dark skin? Hey besties, so we went shopping. And really quickly, let me know what you guys think about my hair. I've been trying out different styles and I've been loving this kind of like heatless curl type of style. I've been wearing my hair like this to work for like the past three weeks and I'm loving it. The middle part is just giving big Diana Ross. Like, I don't know. It's really giving me life. It's giving me what it needs to give me. So let me know if y'all like it and if y'all want to see a tutorial because I would definitely be down. But y'all the sephora savings event your girl went dumb i went dumb for the sale like why did i shop four times i shopped the sale four different times you guys and what's crazy is i was really thinking that i was a rouge member thinking that i had the 20 percent off thinking that i could start shopping on the 14th your girl was dead wrong i don't know what happened i don't know sephora up there minimum that you have to spend to be a rouge but i was a rouge last year and now all of a sudden i'm a vib like i didn't understand what the heck happened so i only had 15 percent, but your girl really put that 15 percent to you so it is what it is a sale is a sale i got everything i needed everything i wanted and i'm super excited to show you guys what i got so if y'all want to see what i got from the spring sephora savings event sale just keep on watching all right y'all first things first i start with my big bag so this was my first order i did an in-store pickup at my local sephora i got a ton of products i think i got like six or seven products let's dive into what i have here i'm not going in any type of order i'm just going to be pulling things out and talking about them so first First things first is the tatcha rice wash and y'all know if you watched my wish list video y'all know that this is my favorite face wash but when i tell you guys this face wash is really the truth if you are suffering from dry skin or anything else like this face wash is literally liquid gold i love it so i had to get a new one i ran out maybe in like december january ish so i was in desperate need of a new one and i didn't want to repurchase it until the sale so i'm glad i got it a little bit definitely goes a long way all right next thing i have is is the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. It is the matching moisturizer to the face wash and I love this liquid gold chef's kiss. I did repurchase a new one of these I think back in like January because I had ran out and like I said this is my my staple skincare like I can't be running out of my staple skincare and not repurchasing so I did repurchase the face cream and the face cream does retail for $80 but it honestly truly is worth it I'm about halfway done with the one I'm currently using and it definitely does last a long time like I said just like the face wash a little bit definitely goes a long way and honestly truly if you're on the fence on investing in good quality skin care i'd say go for it a lot of these products definitely do what they say they're going to do they are pricey but a little bit goes a long way and they are going to last you months at least six months honestly truly so i definitely would recommend going ahead and biting the bullet y'all next thing is this one size on till dawn mattifying waterproof setting spray i fell into the trap I fell into the trap. So Patrick Starr, he made like a little promo video for this on TikTok. And one of my mutuals, she like stitched the video basically like drenching her face in water as well. And she used a white towel and nothing transferred. And I was like, I have really oily skin. Let me try the setting spray. I really do want to try the primer, but it was sold out at the time that I was purchasing. But I'm going to go back for that primer. I'm definitely going back. And I used this today. I just put it back in the packaging for y'all. But when I tell you, it's so light weight and you automatically see the difference in your makeup and i hope you guys can see the difference in my makeup granted my makeup has not been as good as it usually is because i just have not been feeling any of my products i haven't been feeling like doing my makeup i only do my makeup like i told y'all before to get on here and come talk to y'all about different things but when i tell y'all this is the truth i got the mini and i definitely will be repurchasing i'll let you guys know how long the mini lasts but like i said i don't do my makeup that often so it might last me some months so 
definitely glad I picked this up. So the next thing is Slather by Topicals and I'm super excited to try this out. I just recently found this esthetician on TikTok and I've been loving her videos. She was talking about this product. She was saying that Topicals does what it says it's going to do. So this is an exfoliating body serum and the esthetician I found, I'll probably try to like put her name somewhere maybe in the description box, maybe on the screen. I, I gotta see when I'm editing but she was saying that when you are doing the skincare for your face it's good to sync it up with your body skincare so if you're doing an exfoliating treatment on your face you should be doing it on your skin as well the same night so I was like okay cool and I do want to get my body skin right for the summertime so I got this I'm super excited to try it and the next thing I got is also by topicals it is the high roller ingrown tonic so this is really great for ingrown hairs it has salicylic acid glycolic acid niacinamide and zinc PCA so I will be using this for like my underarms and my bikini line anywhere where I get ingrown hairs I'll be using this I'm super excited to see how this works I really really hope it works people have been raving about it so I'll let y'all know how it works and the last thing in this first order is Fame by Paco Rabanne. I was going to get the full size. I honestly truly was going to get the full size. But I was like, you know what? Just get the travel because y'all know my fragrance collection is like very extensive. I have so many full sizes. I have fragrance shelves and my perfumes can't even fit on the shelves anymore. Like I have to get more shelves. Like I don't have any more perfume storage. So I was like, let me just get this um, set. And it, it was really great for the price. It was only $35 and it comes with a 0.14 fluid ounce and a 0.34 fluid ounce so let's open it and see how big these perfumes are oh they're honestly truly a really decent size so the travel perfume that it comes with is like a really nice size it's like your regular like travel rollerball size but this is a spray so I really love it let's smell it because I honestly truly have not smelled this so let me spray it on myself and let's let it dry Mm, I already like am liking this what are the notes like I read the notes online but I really wasn't paying attention I just knew that I wanted it and if I didn't like it I would send it back but I'm already loving this y'all I'm this is so I'm getting mango from it I'm getting vanilla I'm getting white floral I'm loving this for the summertime yeah I'm definitely glad I bought this $35 for a travel y'all know if you watched my what's in my work bag video y'all know I love me a good travel set I keep travel sets in all my purses I'm obsessed with this and then it comes with this little tiny miniature bottle of like this is what the actual bottle looks like so I definitely will be putting the big size on my wish list for my birthday Christmas whenever so friends family boyfriend this is on my wish list don't ask me what I want this is one of the things I want so that is all for my first order let's move on to my next purchase so when I was making that first order there was one thing in my cart that was not available at my local Sephora so I did have to order it online so that is this package right here it is um the topicals faded mist it just has kojic acid transnexamic acid alpha arbutin niacinamide and licorice root and glycolic acid so this is really great for fading any discoloration on the body i'm the victim of eczema so this will be really great for making sure i just have even skin tone and again making sure my skin is right and nice for the summertime so as far as all the topical stuff i definitely will keep y'all posted on how i feel like they work and if i even like them i might even do a skincare routine so stay tuned for that but moving on to my third purchase of this sale and y'all keep in mind I was like ordering back to back to back like I was ordering one day and then the next day like oh shoot but I need this too oh shoot but I gotta try this so yeah I actually went into Sephora for this purchase while I was picking up the first purchase and y'all the girl I met in Sephora the sales girl I didn't get her name I didn't get her Instagram I should have but shout out to you because you made me spend some money <laughs> they should give her a promotion so this is the next order so this is the first thing I went in for so like I said I went in to pick up my in-store order but I did forget to order this while I was online so I was like oh in store I'll smell it to see if I actually really want it and if I want it I'll get it and y'all clearly I wanted it clearly I liked it so this is the way body cream and the scent St. Bart's all of the girls on TikTok Instagram YouTube all of the girls have been raving about this scent and honestly it doesn't disappoint 
y'all oh my gosh they need a perfume this is giving very much summer very much tropical very much outside i'm obsessed with this this smells so freaking good i'm definitely glad i picked this up this is the 7.5 ounce and it retails for 32 dollars. so the next thing is a fragrance and i actually went into sephora wanting to smell the new um kayali yum but they do not have it at my local sephora i think the guy was like they only get like three at a time and like they sold out like this so my friend had smelled Kayali Eden and she said she really liked it she got the travel size so I ended up smelling it and clearly I did not get the travel size shout out to that girl who was helping me in Sephora because she really convinced me that I needed this and honestly truly I did like I said I was just gonna get the travel size but then I smelled it and I was like okay she scanned it to see how much it was and I thought it was a hundred dollars because if you know Kayali the uh 1.7 ounces are usually a hundred dollars but for some reason which I did not know this some of them are a hundred some of them are 89 and this one just so happens to be 89 and i'm in love so i was like yeah i need it it is less than i thought it was and i get the discount 15 percent oh yeah so i was like yeah just throw it in the bag <laughs> this is kali eden juicy apple 01 it is the 1.7 like i said and the notes are juicy red apple wild berries jasmine lychee vanilla flower and sensual musk and when i tell you edible so freaking edible honestly truly I'm not gonna lie, this might be top two for me. I have no other apple scents in my collection. This is very different and I love it. It smells like Snapple apple like just so delicious so yummy and fun fact snapple apple is my favorite snapple so when i smelled this i was just like edible so yeah i am very happy i got this i definitely do recommend you guys go and see your nearest support and smell it because you will not be disappointed and the last thing i got from this order is the nest balinese coconut perfume oil now i do have the madagascar vanilla perfume oil by nest and i actually really do love it i have it in this travel size because i think the big size is like 130 dollars but the travel size is only 35 and when i tell y'all my travel size is like all the way down here but i will repurchase that another time but i was like oh they have a new one and i actually love the way it smells it smells so tropical so coconut like i know i definitely will be getting a lot of wear out of this this summer and this honestly truly was an impulse buy like i was at the register and i was over shopping i was over spending my money but then I was like, hold on. And my friend was like, yeah, you need it. <laughs> and I threw it in the cart. So <laughs> Sephora got me. But I love these perfume oils because when I tell y'all, they last and they are perfect for layering. I'm curious to see how this smells with the Eden. I feel like that might be a, a hit. But I'm definitely glad that I got this. Definitely recommend it. And the last thing I got is actually not here yet. I actually ordered um, this item the day after I ordered the Faded Mist. But it says it won't be here until this Thursday. And I was like super duper eager to film this video for you guys. And get it out and let you guys know that your girl shopped till she dropped. And I still was thinking about shopping some more today today was the last day but i have self-control so i didn't i didn't i was like there's gonna be another sale you're gonna have another paycheck <laughs> So yeah, I did not shop today. But the last thing I did order is the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm in the color Pink Sugar. Y'all, Pink Sugar is always out of stock. I put the notification on for Pink Sugar and literally the next day while I was at work, I got the notification that it was back in stock. And when I tell y'all, this is always sold out. It's currently sold out right now. It's currently the only one sold out. It's always freaking sold out. So I knew I had to just hurry up and hop it i copped it it's on the way i'm super excited but i definitely will be trying out other shades like i definitely do want to try out the vanilla beige and vanilla see how i like them i'm really really hoping that i like the pink sugar and i'll probably update you guys on instagram when it comes and how i like it and how i like all these products so yeah that was the fourth and final purchase of the sephora sale that i made but yeah besties so that is all i got for the sephora sale i am super duper excited to try out all of these products because most of these products are new to me but comment down below and let me know what you guys got during the sephora sale let me know if you're a rouge vib or insider i'm hoping all my besties are rouges because your girl will be a rouge by the end of this year trust me trust and believe because i don't know what they did i don't know how i stopped being a rouge but that's crazy to me but yeah besties don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see y'all the next one. Bye.